Hello everybody, it's Brandon again and welcome back to another Chrome OS Flex video. Uh, it's been about a month since my last video. Um, I was doing so many YouTube videos I started falling behind on my real work with Ape Apps. So uh, I gotta go back and uh, work on some of the stuff that actually pays me. But we do have some exciting Chrome OS Flex news today so I thought I probably ought to get a video out about it. And that is that Chrome OS Flex Stable is now on version 105. Uh, which is good, because although I've scoured around for what might be new in this release, and most of it is just improvements and bug fixes, uh, in my opinion, that was pretty badly needed on Chrome OS Flex. Uh, I don't think 104 was a very good issue. Even after it got to stable, I was having crashing problems with the Linux containers, and I know a lot of you guys have in the comments also. So I think 105 is going to work a lot better. I know on the dev channel, 105 worked better for me, and I got a lot of less a lot less complaints about it on the uh, channel comments, so that's good. So here's 105. Uh, when you first update to it, you get their new uh, window, the What's New with Chrome OS Flex window, and it usually doesn't change from one update to another, I've noticed. They say uh, here, new light and dark themes. I think that was already there in 104, but basically what they're talking about is if you go to, if you right click on your desktop and say set wallpaper and style, um, here I keep mine on auto, but you can also easily switch it dark, light, and then auto is, I think in the evening, it just shuts, turns it to dark, so that's kind of neat. And so yeah, other than that, I know if you have real Chrome OS and not Flex, I guess there's some new uh, game bar thing that they've added for Android games. I might test that out on the, uh, Lenovo tablet that I have Chrome OS on. I haven't looked at that yet, but apparently that's the uh, main new feature in this version of Chrome OS, which obviously on Flex, we don't have Android, so that's nothing. But uh, yeah, as far as I know, this is mostly a bug fix and a stability type of update. So if you guys find something new in this one that I've missed, be sure to let me know in the comments. And um, I think next, after this one, I'm going to switch this back over to the dev channel and see what's cooking over there, since I haven't looked at dev for a while, and usually that's where you find a little more exciting, a little more excitement. So, if you have Chrome OS Flex on your system, go ahead and give it an update. Oh, and by the way, if the uh, update prompt doesn't come up for you automatically, here's how you do it. Just click down here, say settings, and go to about Chrome OS, and you click on check for updates. And it'll tell you there's a new version, it'll download, and it'll restart for you. And if you're not on the stable channel, which I kind of recommend everybody use stable now because it's gotten pretty good, you, uh, you go to that same About Chrome OS thing, you click on Additional Details, and you can change your channel. A lot of times when you, if you have one of the older USB sticks, it'll be in the dev branch automatically. I think the new ones you make uh, default to stable now. But uh, if they don't, you can change your channel here. Or if you want to check out dev, just click on change channel, switch to developer, and uh, that's probably what we're going to be trying for the next video here. But um, I know there's a lot of requests in the comments for other things you guys want me to check, and I am way behind on that. But like I said, I had to actually start doing some real work so I could eat. But um, I'll, I'll put out a few more videos. Um, I apologize to everybody for getting behind, but there... There's a huge backlog of questions and stuff for me to try to install now, so I will get to that. It'll be fun. Everybody will love the videos, I think. And uh, keep the comments and suggestions coming. I will get to them at some point. Once again, thank you all for watching. And as always, I do hope that everybody on here has a good day. Goodbye now.